Yo, what's going on everybody? Funky Friday has just released another new update. This time we got the Hex update. We're going to be covering everything in this new update video. So make sure you smack the like and subscribe and let's get right into it. So what's going to be new for January 7th? We've got three new mods. We ended up getting four new animations, four new maps and also a new setting to test out here. And I guess you could say that we got a new welcome board too. I kind of like the new sleek style. So our cheapest new animation is going to be the B3 girl. We're going to get this for 450 points. This is what this animation is going to look like on idle, left, down, up, and then right as well. Pretty simple. It's a nice animation for the price. Here's some gameplay. I mean, yeah, it's one of those animations where it's gonna be nice and simple. It's not gonna break the bank or anything like that. So the girl animation is a very nice one. Next up, we got the hex detected animation as well. Not to be confused with the old hex animation. This one's gonna run you 550 points. This is what this animation looks like on idle. You kind of like slanted toward the right, left, down, up, and then right as well. Another nice one. <laughs> It's definitely going to show a lot more emotion compared to the B3 girl animation, so this one's going to be nice, especially if you are a lot more of a livelier animation. Next up, we do got a new Shaggy animation as well. This one's going to be different comparing it to the old Shaggy, which got renamed to 0.002%. 600 points. This is what the new Shaggy animation looks like on idle. You're swearing your arms left, down, up, and then right as well. Kind of like, you know, he's just swinging his arms, which is pretty cool. <laughs> Classic Shaggy animation. I think this is another great one as well. It seems a bit too simple in my opinion though, so maybe they might have to drop the price down. Maybe I'm not really sure, but I just think 600 is a little bit too much for that animation. And then our most expensive animation is going to be the Cassette Girl animation. This is going to cost you 700 points. This is what this one's going to look like on idle, left, down, up, and then right as well. You actually got a model of a cigarette in your mouth. I wonder how they got past Roblox with that one, huh? Yeah, they actually got me with that one. I thought it was going to be like a cigarette or something, but that's actually a lollipop that you're holding in your mouth. That's pretty cool. So along with all the new animations, we ended up getting a ton of new map backgrounds as well. This one's going to be one of them, which is Hex's Court. It's pretty much the basketball court from the Hex mod. And honestly, this looks really great. I see a lot of secrets as well. I see somebody back over there holding a basketball in his hands. And I also see somebody trying to rave at us behind that bush over there too. I'm not sure exactly who these people are though. But this map definitely looks like it was made well. No lag whatsoever. Very nice. This time we got yet another new map background to showcase. This one kind of looks like an old simulator of sorts, you know. Kind of reminds you of like the good old Roblox days with simulator games. Pretty simple. I'm not exactly sure what mod this actually comes from. But it looks pretty cool, I guess. So if you have a toasty bakery, you also need a toasty kitchen too, right? So this is going to be the kitchen right here. You're going to be cooking in front of an audience of bobs and other people in the audience too that are just like staring at you. Pretty scary, I know. <laughs> Imagine cooking in front of a huge entire group of people. It's pretty crazy. And then we also have the MLG alleyway map as well. This one's really cool because it has a bunch of artists and bar a bunch of drawings on the wall too. Like we got a picture of a mouse holding pizza. Sanic the Hedgehog. And what makes things even crazier is that we got a TV with giant googly eyes too. So it's some pretty crazy things with this map. But overall, pretty well done too. So we do have a new setting to go over as well. This is going to be instant animation snapping. Let's go check out what this thing does exactly. So basically, if you have this setting on, it transitions the animation back to idle without having those extra smooth animation transitioning into the idle state. You kind of just snap instantly toward the idle animation, which some people do enjoy. Some people do like the smooth transition into idle as well with having it off. So personal preference, really. It's a pretty cool setting to have. 
But yeah, that's pretty much it for all the new features. We're going to be trying out a new song from each of the mods onto public servers here. Alright guys, here we go. This time we got LCD from the Hex mod. They finally updated the Hex mod after a couple of months too, man. Like, Hex has been one of the first mods ever created for Friday Night Funkin, and it's pretty nice to see that they finally updated the game with a bunch of new songs as well. LCD is gonna be the last song for the mod. It's also gonna be like the last hurrah for the mod as well. It's a very great song. Very long song as well. You can see that. Three minutes long, boys. So, it's gonna be a pretty banger of a song, especially in this beginning part right here. Can I pump you right up? For the bit for the later stages over here it's a pretty nice and slow part so far in the beginning i think it's nice and slow but once you try to play longer into the song as you go further into it it's gonna start to get a little bit more difficult and it starts to pick it up a little bit too it's definitely not an overly charted song that's one thing for sure like most songs these days can't be overly charted but this one keeps it nice and simple towards the basics towards like what hex is all about you know like, when the mod first came out, it didn't feature any crazy chartings or anything like that, and they kind of stuck to that style, which is pretty nice to see. This is gonna be really close, man! Oh my gosh, bro! We both got two misses, and accuracy-wise, we're pretty much neck-to-neck -neck right here, man. It's gonna go down to the wire right here, boys. I wonder who's gonna win, me or Tree Man? Oh, man, it's gonna be wicked close right here, bro! Oh! We beat him by like 300 points, bro. That's close. All right, guys, moving on to another last song, this time from the B3 Remix mod. This one's going to be Nom Nom. And this is going to be the most difficult song. Oh, my God. You guys can already see with the charting, man. It's going to be the most difficult song from the B3 Remix. And honestly, it's definitely really fast, bro. Like, it's the, the charting's crazy on this one, man. You got to be really fast with your reflexes. You wanna try to beat this song right here, bro? Like, I'm having trouble already, bro. This is gonna be a long song, bro. Oh my god, bro. This is gonna be ridiculous, man. Oh my god. How do I have 47 misses already, man? This is a skill issue on my part. I've really been playing Funky Friday too much lately. So I've been kind of like taking a little bit of a break, slowing down a little bit. But, man, dude, this is a pretty difficult song. I'm not gonna lie about that. The charting's pretty iffy. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty insane, man. It's pretty insane. Come on. Quit resisting already. <laughs> What do you say? I don't even know what she said, man. That was weird. That was weird. So many jacks and also so many chords as well in this song, bro. Like, you just gotta be overall, you just gotta be ready for it, man. I think this song's one of the songs where it's gonna take you a couple of tries just to, like, figure out the charting and everything like that. If you're doing a first-time playthrough, like what I'm doing right now, you're not gonna have any idea how the patterns are gonna go like. You gotta play it a couple times in order to really understand how to get each part down, man. It's just one of those songs. But yeah, guys, this is definitely a great song, man. Like, that ending right there was amazing, too. I got my butt beat, but hey, it was a great song. And let's not forget about City Funk as well. This was from the Cassette Girl mod as well. This is gonna be pretty interesting here, man. Again, with the animation, they got me with that animation right there, man. I thought that was gonna be, like, you know, a cigarette or something, but they actually got me with that, man. It's actually lollipop. I mean, then, like, once again, they can't add it into Roblox because Roblox is really, like, you know, sponsor smoking or anything like that, which, honestly, smoking is really bad, so make sure you don't smoke. But it's a really great workaround, working with the lollipop right there. Mod-wise, I haven't really played the Cassette Girl mod yet, but it definitely sounds really cool so far. Kind of gives you an urban trap remix of the modern take, which is pretty nice. Yeah, I like this one. That just pumps you up, man. It really does. I think my favorite part of the song is definitely gotta be when the girl goes like, ah, ah. I can't really say it, like, I can't really replicate it, but you know what I mean. It has a really cool charm with the song as well. Well, we're out here trying to enjoy the nice trap remix. Looks like somebody's playing on the xylophone in the background right there. Nice and short song, but definitely sweet and highly recommend you guys playing it. It's an awesome song. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this update, guys. Pretty, a lot of animations and backgrounds, but pretty small update song and content-wise. But make sure you guys smack the like and subscribe. I do cover every single update on Funky Friday. We'll see you guys on the next one.